What's up guys, it's TechNewby here. Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak the iPad 2 and the iPhone 4S on Windows. As of right now, there's only the CLI version. Absent is yet to be ported onto the Windows, so this is the only alternative. But special thanks to Kimlo on Mac Rumor Forms for giving us a good detailed uh, text tutorial. And I'm going to show you a video tutorial to make it much more easier for those who are having trouble with it. So I'm going to post the download links in the description for what you need to download. And it's just only one thing. So when you're done downloading the folder you're going to go ahead and go to your username and then download you're going to drag and drop the folder into this location which is the downloads folder the reason why is because I want everybody to follow the same pathway that I'm following so nobody gets confused alright after that you want to go back to the start menu and then search CMD alright you're going to get this, you got a black window here I'm going to go ahead and zoom in I apologize for the background for sometimes the you can't read the text but let's get to it. The first thing you want to type is CD downloads and just press enter. After that, you want to type in CD synject underscore 0.4.3 and press enter. If you want to pause this video, go ahead. I know I'm talking way too fast and I'm um, sorry again. The next thing you want to uh, type in is synject.exe space dash i space payloads slash jailbreak dot mobile config and then press enter so uh, yeah like I said I apologize for going too fast and for having uh, backgrounds that make it hard for you to read the text I'll post the text tutorial in the description for those who are who would need it All right, after you press enter you're gonna go to your iPad you're gonna see that it pops up settings and it's gonna tell you to install a profile we're gonna go ahead and install profile so you can tap it. Or it's going to give you another pop-up. Just go ahead and tap on install now. It's going to tell you to enter a password, but we're going to go ahead and tap next. Alright, and it's going to say profile installed. Go ahead and type on done. Or tap on done. Alright, now we're going to go back to our computer. Alright, so we're back on our computer now. And the next thing you want to type out is well, all right, synject.exe space dash j space payload. So just type that out. Of course, this is all uh, lowercase. And after that, you're just gonna press enter, and it's just gonna begin like a few lines of text. Just let it stay there there for a few seconds. Uh, this part seems to be uh, giving users some error, which I'll talk about later in this video. But I still want to continue on with this tutorial. All right, after that, you're gonna type in the next following text. It is synject.exe space dash w alright when you're gonna press enter you're gonna get off like a big load of text going down your screen that's alright we're gonna go back to our iPad alright we're gonna go back to our iPad now on the top it should say VPN you wanna go ahead and tap on and it's gonna say VPN connecting you're gonna leave it like that you're gonna get a pop-up message saying error do not tap anything on it, just leave it there. So we're going to get it right now. Alright, there we go. We got the error message. Don't do anything. And if you look into the CMD uh, window, you should see it's doing its work. And there you go. The iPad 2 is now going to reboot. And after this, you're pretty much done. You'll let the iPad 2 reboot or iPhone 4, depending on which one you're doing on. And yeah, that's it. So we're just going to wait. I'm going to go ahead and skip this part because it took a little bit. But it shouldn't take more than two minutes at most. All right, we got the lock screen on, so we're gonna go ahead and slide to unlock. And on the second page, you should get Cydia, just like so. And when you pretty much first boot up, Cydia's gonna tell you that preparing file system is gonna close out. But uh, thanks to Kimbelo at Mac Rumor Forums uh, for putting out this guide, um, and to the others that helped contribute. But so far right now absent is not yet released for windows hopefully it'll be released later today if not maybe somewhere before this week ends but as of now this is, this is the only option we have left it's a little bit more complicated and it's not gonna mess up your phone at all it's just gonna give you an error message and the only way I got this to work was doing a restore on my iPad 2 I did do this like five to six times on the iPad 2 that I was on with all my information and stuff but the first time I tried it on the freshly restored iPad 2 on iOS 5.0.1 and it actually worked. So see if that works in case you're still getting errors like the fatal line error 
or if the VPN is not rebooting your uh, iPad to your iPhone 4S. But that's about it, guys. That's all I got for you today. If you like this video, please like it up. If you have any more questions, post a comment. I'll post a uh, link to the forum in case more people are having problems. The, you can discuss it there with Kimlo, me, and other people that are going to help you out. And, um, yeah, if you want to see more videos like this one, please subscribe. But, yeah, stay tuned. I'll upload more videos on what to have on your iOS 5 jailbroken iPad 2 or iPhone 4S. Thanks.